Hello, Tolu. Hello. How are you? I'm fine. Wow. Mr. Galavanti. Eh? <laughs> I'm okay. I'm okay. Man, Bele. Yeah, I like this your setup. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, I just did my table, you know. <laughs> Microphone and everything. Yeah, uh, oh, oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> so Bowney. Oh, fine, fine, fine uh, for myself. Uh, where are you where are you now? I'm in my house in Ibadan. Uh, Ibadan. Okay. Yeah. A what a, what a area of, of Ibadan you do you live? That's a jaw, a jaw area. Okay. Okay. Yeah, well, I, I don't really know Ibadan. I have a family who have been in Ibadan for over 60 years. You know, mm. I visited them maybe twice, three times in my life. They normally come to Lagos, so we, okay. we see often in Lagos and then, yeah, yeah. But, uh, so, yeah. I told you, See, uh, I'm happy you are here. I know you are very, very busy. You know, like uh, it took us time to arrange this uh, meeting because uh, you are always going from here from one place to another. So I'm um, uh, thank you, thank you very much to, to make for taking out the time to to be here. Mm. So let let's start. Let's start. See, tell my audience who you are and what you do. Yeah, thank you very much for having me. My name is Tolu Lokbe Olukokun. I'm a Nigerian. Currently, I co-founded uh, Think Bikes, yeah. uh, which is a micro mobility company manufacturing two and three wheelers, and for last mile transportation in Nigeria. Um, basically, that's that's what I do currently. Okay. So, so just give us some some little history about you. Where where did you go to school? You know, because you see, why, why I'm asking you that because uh, I have young people listening. Okay, so I want them to know. Hey, if Tolu could do what, what he's doing, then me myself, I have, I can also do it. So I like I like to share this kind of uh, information with them. Yes, uh, I grew up in a town called Okeo. Uh, I had my primary school and um, secondary school education there. Okay, is uh, in our state, Kajala local government. Okay, and um, we I, I grew up in a family of seven with both parents, five children. I'm the fourth of the fifth children, and I mean, upbringing was fine. My parents believed in education. Yeah, uh, and they spent all their time giving us that education, all their resources as well. They were civil servants, mm. um, uh, even though Nigeria wasn't treating them right, strikes all over, salary being hold. We used yeah. to have a farm where we get things. Uh, where ah, we farm things. good one. Yeah, we we eat from it, yam, cassava, different things. You know, um, yeah. education, tertiary education brought me out of Okeo to Ibadan. Mm. I was in the Polytechnic of Adon. I had my ND HND there. In what, what course? Mechanical engineering. Okay. I majored in automobile and um, uh, doing my own thing because I didn't want to get entangled in the civil service work <laughs> you know, because of the experience I had with my yeah, parents. Your parents, you know? yes. So, um, then after which, uh, uh, I stopped. I was working at City Firm. I had an ICT Firm for myself where I was, uh, um, you know, making softwares for people, collecting money. I was just doing fine. At the point in school, I was having a laundry as well. Wow. Uh, after a laundry service, yes. After which uh, I, I went for service, I came back. I was still continuing the laundry. I had car wash. I had wind center. So I just you, are, you have been a, a, a <laughs> service provider of all sorts. Uh, That's yes, good. Yes, because That's good. you know, early in the days, I read a lot of books about think big and grow rich, uh, think uh, rich that what that. Yeah, and all mm -hmm. of those informed that multiple stream of income is a kind of thing. But the limitation was that I wasn't thinking of. Uh, maybe I wasn't aware of what they call startups. I was just uh, planting <laughs> small businesses everywhere. 
mm. uh, you know and uh, yeah the the, uh, the concept of startup is, is is relatively new actually yeah yeah so basically um that's then one day I got a call. Do I want to work in the Polytechnic for Adorno? Then I was like, okay, that's 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 a new experience. Then uh that took another 10 years journey, you know. In, in between, I was going to school to improve my education, I had yeah. another degree, another postgraduate course, then masters. At the end of the day, I have two masters, you know. That has been the journey so far until I resigned. Uh, I left Polytechnic in 2021 to join, no, 2020 to join Federal Investor of Ayekiti. Okay. Then uh, that's where I resigned from in 2022. I spent roughly two years there. Yeah. I resigned, then I focused on Thing Bikes, and okay. that's where we are right now. Good, good, good. So 